anger. Tom Bauer finally drops Major Bombshell on Harry and Meghan for return plot to insult Royal. Royal author Tom Bauer, who is currently writing a biography of Meghan Markle, says that the next few months will show where Prince Harry and Meghan's mindsets are when it comes to returning to the UK. Prince Harry is facing the ultimate test and dilemma on whether he should return to the UK to visit, a royal author has claimed. Since Harry and wife Meghan Markle quit as senior royals and started a new life in California in 2020, the prince has only returned to Britain twice. Both of those times he came alone with Meghan staying at home with son Archie, who also hasn't returned to the UK since moving to the US. Meanwhile, the couple's eight-month-old daughter Lilibet, who was born in California, has never been to Britain, nor has she met her great-grandmother the Queen or grandfather Prince Charles. Currently, Harry is in the middle of a legal challenge against the Home Office to be allowed police protection for him and his family when he is in the UK, which he says he is willing to pay for. And with a memorial for his late grandfather Prince Philip later this month and the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations in June, royal author Tom Bauer believes this has presented Harry with the ultimate test. Mr Bauer, who is currently writing a biography of Meghan, told Closer magazine, the next few months will be the ultimate test for Harry, the ultimate dilemma. He insists he adores his grandmother, so will he come back to support her at Prince Philip's memorial service, and will he come back to support her and celebrate her reign in the Platinum Jubilee? These are milestone moments and, sadly, time is running out. If he doesn't come back, it's a clear statement of where lies his loyalty and his own interest. He's had many opportunities to return home and spend time with his family, and hasn't, but this really will show where his and Meghan's mindsets are. And if they don't come back soon, and Lilibet doesn't meet the Queen and Harry doesn't celebrate her life and reign with her, it could be something he comes to regret forever. Although Harry and Meghan's lives now firmly seem to be in California, they still have some charity interests in the UK. Just yesterday, it was announced that the couple's Archul Foundation is awarding a grant to UK-based charity SmartWorks, which Meghan is still a patron of. SmartWorks, which helps women get back to work is among four charities that Archul is supporting in order to mark Women's History Month. In a poll that ran from 10am to 4pm on Wednesday March 25th, asked its readers, do you think Prince Harry and Meghan Markle deserve the right to change their minds and resume some royal duties, after a royal expert said the Duke and Duchess of Sussex might wish to make a return once Prince Charles ascends the throne? The poll gathered a whopping 10,782 participants, with hundreds of comments left in a lively debate. Overwhelmingly, the majority, 97%, 10,483, said no. Meghan and Harry should not be allowed to come back as part-time royals. Just 2%, 267, said yes, they should be allowed to change their minds and come back, and a further 1%, 32 people, said they just didn't know. In the comments, it was clear that people felt too much had happened between the Duke and Duchess and the rest of the royal family. Username Fred Bear said, succinctly, I think they've incinerated that particular bridge. Readers also pointed to the bombshell Oprah interview Meghan and Harry appeared in last year, as well as Harry's upcoming memoir, which reports suggest contains damaging allegations about the royal world. One user, Giant Dwarf wrote, if they had simply left that would be one thing. Since leaving, however, they have gone out of their way to badmouth their family. Others said the couple should stick to the choice they made when they decided to live a quieter life. Username D.Rad said, they made it clear, they wanted a life out of the limelight. Clear.